Hello, it's AdorkableList77, and today we're going to be doing an outfit of the day, so let's get started. So first off, I have my shirt that's from Tune Plus, and then over that I have a kind of pinkish orange coral sweater that I got from Ross. It's like three-fourths length of the length. Um, this is pretty old. I've had this for a while, but I really, really like it. Um, I also have my mixed metals necklace that I got from Burlington. And then I'm wearing these super cute printed skinny jeans. I actually really like these. They have holes in them. Um, that's just how they are. These are actually from Forever 21, and I think you can still get them in store. Um, they're on clearance and right now Forever 21 is having a sale on their clearance section it's 50% um, off their clearance and these are super cute these have tribal print and the prints not too big where it overwhelms my body and I actually really like the colors as you can see they have a hint of pale blue and kind of like a orange color in there and of course they have white and the denim is darker and it has like the Aztec print and because the pattern is vertical it elongates my legs and makes them look slimmer again also darker denim of course that the pattern since the pattern is super super busy I um, didn't want to wear a lot of other things that have pattern so I chose to wear things that were more um, color blocked and of course I'm wearing these super cute sandal heels with like a wooden brown base um, I got these from Ross a long time ago and they're super cute I really like them you can see the detail of the shoe it's right there and right there all right okay so makeup wise um, I wore my Bobbi Brown foundation it's the stick foundation and it's in natural tan and then I used my LA Girl Pro Conceal in the color Pure Beige and the color Creamy Beige. And then for the under eye area, I used the It Cosmetics Tan Bye Bye Under Eye Concealer to get rid of the dark circles. And then I set that with my Rimmel London Stay Matte Not Flat. Um, powder foundation and then I used my elf blush and cream contour kit that has a bronzer and I used the bronzer part to give my skin more of a glowy look and then I topped certain areas with the flower beauty cosmetics shimmering goddess blush duo and bronzer duo and I just used the bronzer. And then for the cheeks, I wanted them to appear a little bit more dewy and fresh looking. So I used my Sleek Cosmetics California IA blush palette. And I used the kind of more coral, the deeper coral color from there. I forgot the name. And then I topped it with Makeup Geek Summer Fling to set it. Just because my, sting, my skin is so oily, it tends to disappear on me. And then for the lips, I used the NYX Retractable Lip Liner in Grapefruit. And I went over that with the Wet n Wild's uh, Pretty Persimmon um, Lipstick to kind of give it more of a pinky orange color instead of a straight up red color because persimmon is more of like a red orange versus a pinky orange so I want to turn it more pinky. And then for my highlight I used the Benefit Their Real 
um, oh, no. For my highlight, I used the Benefit What's Up Highlighter. Oh my god, I didn't use any mascara. I don't even know why I said Benefit, they're real. But um, on the eyes, I used a combination of the Milani Shadow Sticks. I used the Champagne Color, and then I used the Deluxe Brown. And I kind of went with the lighter color on the inside, and on the outside, I went with the Deluxe Brown. Blended it out underneath as well, and then I used the Maybelline Bronze and Chic Eye Studio Palette. And I took the dark brown and went into the crease and kind of smoked that out. And then I used a peachy color for the highlight and kind of made it more soft. Um, it is definitely more of um, like a softer nighttime look. Just because me and my boyfriend are going to go out and it's more in the evening. So I hope you guys enjoyed this outfit of the day. And I hope you have a great day. Bye!